When you think of protein, you think about meat and muscle, but in fact, they are much more than that. Let me explain you why. Proteins do constitute our muscles, but not only. After water, they are the second constituent of our body and of our skin too. There are two main types of protein. The structural protein that form the framework of our tissues. The collagen, for example, structures our dams. The functional proteins that are the workers of our body. Aquaporins, for example, transport water within the skin. But by the way, what is a protein? Well, a protein is a long molecule made up of small molecules linked together, like a pearl necklace. These pearls are the amino acids. They are about 20 different ones, and their order in the protein is very important, like the order of the letters in a word. From these 20 amino acids, our body can make more than 20,000 protein. It is a real vital capital for our body. It is called the proteome. But how do we make proteins? Well, each of our cells contains all the recipes to make all the proteins of our body. These recipes are written in our DNA. Of course, our cells don't make all this protein at the same time. They only make the proteins that are needed. First, the cell will make a copy of the protein's recipe. This copy is called messenger RNA. This strand of mRNA is then transmitted to a protein manufacturing unit that will assemble one by one the different amino acids in order to create the desired protein. Once assembled, every protein necklace must fold into a specific 2D or 3D structure to function properly. This shape is very important, like the shape of a key to open a lock. Some molecules are dedicated to do this job of geometrics modeling, the chaperones. Chaperones can also protect the protein structures from external aggression. Indeed, under stress, proteins can unfold and lose their function. In this case, then must be destroyed and recycled. But some of them can outrun this process. Over time, they accumulate in aggregates, clogging our cells and exhausting our detoxification systems. This is a major cause of premature aging. So now, you understand how important it is to protect the integrity of our proteins and avoid the alteration of our proteome. Guess what? We have a solution for that. So stay tuned and take care.